Hello everyone, this is Deal Mirror, and today we're going to check out Dirt Button, which is a scheduling invoices and video call app, which is in a lifetime deal right now for $49. That means you only pay once and you have it forever. If you want to check out this deal, the link is going to be in the description. So let's just head on over to the dashboard and see how Dirt Button actually works. You can see Dirt Button right here. This is my main dashboard, and right now we have no meetings because we haven't set it up completely. But I'm going to show you really quick what you have to do to set it up, and you're going to say, hey, you know what? This is super easy for me. So head on over to account. Please set up your profile first, your image, your name, company, website, language. And it's also really important. The most important part is set up your time zone because it's gonna everything's going to work with your time zone. So that's really important. Once you have that done, we're going to head on over to payments. Here in payments, you're going to set up your information for the payment gateway. So clients can pay by credit card. Clients can pay later. That means they can pay like in, in the future. And you got this right here. Set up the account. If you want to charge fees, flexible, medium, strict. It just depends. Account. Next thing we're going to do is head on over to ability. Once you set up your ability, you can be able to schedule. So what you have to do is set up the scheduling dates that you will be available to actually do the meeting because we're not available 24 hours. Remember, we have to sleep. Yeah, that's why. So, for example, we have Monday and Monday. Why would we want two Mondays? Let's just say, for example, I set up I'm available on Monday from 11 a.m. to 3 p.m. But you know what? I, I eat from 3 p.m. to 4 p.m. So I jump that hour and then I set up again Monday and I set up from 4 p.m. to 7 p.m. And it just depends on that. Maybe you don't want to schedule Saturday and Sunday so you don't just you just don't add them. Or maybe you just want to do Saturday. If Hey, if someone wants, I'll be available just in the morning from 7 a.m. to 12, p 12 a.m. That's, that's all. 12 p.m. Sorry. And it's, it's super easy to set up. Once you have that, we head on over to Calendar. On Calendar, we already have connected here Google Calendar. You have three options. You can use Google Calendar, you can use Microsoft Calendar, or you can use the Embedded Calendar from Dirt Button. Since we activated Google Calendar, the Embedded Calendar just went away. So what is the, the fun part about Google Calendar? Well, it's actually linked one to the other. What does that mean? If someone schedules on Dirt Button, it's going to show you on your Google Calendar. If you schedule something on Google Calendar, hey, let's just say, you know what, I'm going on vacations if, for, uh, for seven days. It's going to remove those days from Dirt Button, and they won't be able to schedule. Or let's just say, hey, you know what, I made a physical appointment, and I did it on my Google Calendar. It's going to remove that hour or two hours or whatever it's going to take you from the Dirt Button calendar. So it's pretty awesome that you have integrations one to another. Next thing we have is the, hold on, the integrations. So the integrations, what it does, it lets you integrate HTML code to your site. You can either use this link, which is from them, let's check it out, which is gonna take you this to this right here. It might not look so pro to have the, the, the app dirtbutton.com, but if you embed it, it's gonna work wonderfully. What does that give you the option? You can embed it here, the HTML code, and you can actually do the schedule in your site, or you can actually do a pop-up scheduler also in your site. How is that going to look? I'm gonna show you this right now. So I set up the HTML code on this side just for testing. You can see I set up a button which is, hold on, which is this one right here. It's just a booking button and they can go, I can put this button anywhere. It's not gonna mess with the site and super easy. Or you can embed the HTML code so they actually do the scheduling right here. So if I head back to the start, this is how it would show. That's how it would pop up and it looks really nice having a picture. Obviously you can add your own picture, a business picture or whatever you want. And we go next, you schedule the appointment. It's like a 15 minute schedule, $0. Next, you can select the date, the hour. See how I do this right here? And you know what? Let's just say another date. This date, go next, and fill out your information, and you're ready to schedule a booking appointment. What's so awesome about this? You got the name, the email, and phone number, and you got them scheduled. Super easy and super fast. Next thing we can do is, this is the booking link, the one I showed you. We got the integrations. What else do we have right here? I'm sure I'm missing something. Hold on. Okay, here it is. My services. Here are my services. You can do the the, the appointments you want to do. So, for example, I want to add a brand new one. The length of this type of meeting it takes 60 minutes. 60 minutes to do this meeting. Is it going to be a video session, a face to face, or both? Let's just say both. 
Is this going to cost something or is this free? I mean, maybe it's just advice that you're going to give out. Maybe it's a client that you want to grab that you, you're barely going to pitch to them. Or, you know, it, maybe it's a service you already do. Hey, you know what? I'm going to do an SEO service and I'm going to charge $100. Description SEO service. And you just add it that way. See how that's added right there? What other things can we do to this? Well, we can do a break before appointment and a break after appointment. What does that mean? Just to say, if someone schedules this meeting, I want to be free and I want to know that no one's going to schedule something before that. I mean, you're not just going to take one hour and it's just going to jump to the next one. So if someone schedules, I want a break appointment of about 30 minutes. I need 30 minutes. There, there has there, there can't be another appointment before 30 minutes and same thing goes for after so once i finish the meeting i don't want another one right away i want to wait another 30 minutes so it gives you that break next thing you can set up is country address city address and zip see how easy this is to set up i mean you can do it really quick and last but not least when you can see the appointments once they are here well guys this is their button it's pretty awesome price right now 49 dollars for a lifetime deal if you guys want to grab it, the link is going to be in the description. Thank you guys for watching.